welcome back to a new Baking with Rhiannon. So today we are making these little like energy bites or like these little oat balls. They are super simple to make but they taste amazing. You'll love them. So let's get into the recipe. <laughs> so to start this recipe off you're going to need a mixer, some chia seeds, oatmeal, I mean chia seeds, hemp, se hemp seeds, oatmeal, and some peanut butter, and of course, this is optional. I personally also like to include some raisins. So first things first, you're going to want to unplug this, or unwound this, and plug the mixer in. So first thing we're going to do is measure out one third a cup of oats. So we have one third a cup of oats and we're going to put that into the bowl. Next, we are going to take half a cup of peanut butter and put that into the mixture. So I have a fresh jar of peanut butter. And so the peanut butter I use is, um, normally I actually don't use this one, but this is all I had. So we're working with it. <laughs> so the one I have here is all natural, smooth. This one's by Kraft, but you can really use any kind of nut butter that you'd like. I just like peanut butter, so that's what I'm going to use. So we're going to stir this around first, and then we're going to measure it out. Pretty. Looks to be about half. Half cup. All right, and we're gonna add that in to the mixture. Make sure you spoon it all in. After the peanut butter, go set that aside. And we are going to grab some chia seeds now. So for the chia seeds, I put in one tablespoon of chia seeds and one tablespoon of hemp seeds. And then for the raisins, I just have the organic California sun-made raisins. And we're just gonna kind of like eyeball how much it really goes in. Because with the raisins, it's really up to preference. We are going to attach the mixer head to the mixer. Put this in, turn it on, and stir on a, start on a low. And it should just mix up nicely, kind of getting the mixture all together. So right now, it's just a bit too wet. We're gonna add in some more oatmeal into the mixture. So for the actual mixture of the um, I guess you call it batter or the mix. You want it to be kind of like kind of sticky, but also in a way that you can form it into little balls. So for the actual making of the balls, I'm just gonna push that aside. So for the balls, you're just going to grab a large plate and then basically scoop them into small-ish to medium-sized balls. So you roll them around in your hand like this. And then you put it on the plate and you go on to the next one. It's very simple, very easy recipe to make, and they taste really good. <laughs> so these are the final <laughs> Final results of the little peanut butter oatmeal energy bite. They are so tasty and they are so healthy for you. So I hope you guys enjoy having these as much as I love them. And my mom does too. So I'm going to put these in the fridge for about 15 to 20 minutes afterwards. Just might let them firm up a little. You can leave them overnight if you want. Or you can eat them right away if you just can't resist like I do. And I have a little bit of the mix before I actually make them for the balls. It is amazing. Just like, you know, taste testing it. 
I'll leave all the ingredients and like the measurements, uh, approximate measurements in the description box below so you guys can try it out. I hope you guys enjoyed them. Don't forget to thumbs up, comment down below if you like them, hit that subscribe button, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye!